Thinking shout out to the people. But I was surprised. I was surprised. I was surprised. I was surprised. I Very quickly. Yes. Yani, what's your journey to, to, to be? Yani, kwa I discovered that I was a potential when you rap. Before you were a DJ, by the way, eh? yeah. and you were a dancer and you were a rapper. Uh-huh. Eh, Nikishi Pale Rungai. So, you were a rapper and 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 you were a rapper. So you go and that to me that to me rap iko pale kwenye YouTube. Mimi ni rapper moto sana. So uh nilikuwa dancer na rapper back then uh, and then uh, nikakuja nikakuwa DJ. So nika shift. Mimi nadafanya vitu mingi sana. Eh, yeah. nilikuwa dancer. Before nilikuwa DJ nilikuwa dancer na nilikuwa rapper. Ah. Yeah. And then ikawaje um ikawaje ukaingia kwenye. Kwa nini uliingia tu kwenye gospel? What what uh how did you get into God? Unajua mimi first of all nimetoka kwa familia ya wanapenda Kristo na wazazi wangu wamenilea hivyo alafu niliambia Mungu akinibariki na talent ya kuwa DJ ama nikikuja kufanikiwa kama DJ nda kurudishia talent yangu kwako. Aha. That's why I came about. So I kept my word. Aha. Yes. Ulipopata nafasi ukaitumia vizuri. Ndio sasa. Kwenye ngoma ni umeonesha umeonesha uwezo mkubwa sana especially kwenye lab. That's that's really amazing. Tunashukuru sana tunashukuru sana. Tulikuwa tumeenda pale studio tuka my wife akire record album. Then net kwa pale na kimja kibi tukasikuna instrumento ilikuwa pale. So tukaanza tu kusema sitwambie watu story yetu kwa beat. Eh alafu tuambie watu vitu Mungu ametufanyia. Na tushukuru Mungu kwa kwa kwenye kwa hii beat eh uh-huh. tukimwambia vitu eh, tukiambia watu we are grateful kwa mapito uh-huh. mapigo na bado kwa furaha uh-huh. so basically wimbo inamaanisha hivyo so makapos uh, tuna encourage wakuwe kwenye ndoa wakae pamoja au wana date wakuwe pamoja uh-huh. because kuna mapito kuna mapigo na hizo vitu zote okay. so ilikuwa ni more of testimony to us um <laughs> it is actually in testimony pia yes. uh, kwa watu wengi sana na kuna shabiki hapa ambaye ame, ametaka kujua siri ile ambayo imefanya nini kama eh, wapenda nao muweze kudumu katika mm-hmm. ndoa utasema alafu niseme eh anza anza size eh okay this is serious to first of all ni nilikamkurealize the more una draw to god the better you become Mm-hmm. Yaani uki, ukiwa ukiwa relationship yako na Mungu ukiendeleza kwa yani kuende ukiwa songea Mungu mm-hmm. uendelee kuwa rafiki sali nisaidie na Kiswahili. The closer you draw to God. Mm-hmm. Unapojongea zaidi karibu na Mwenyezi Mungu. Yes, yani relationship yako ikuwe tight na Mungu, uh-huh. you become a better person. Uh-huh. So the more mi na bwanangu tumekam kujua Mungu na tukue kama Yesu, uh-huh. yani you learn to be like Christ. Uh-huh for forgiveness tolerance forbearance mm-hmm. unajua vitu hizo vitu Yesu alitufunza uki exercise hizo vitu kwa ndoa na mweke Yesu katikati uh-huh. ndoa inafanya kazi ju watu wengi shida kubwa inakuanga kiburi ama jibe shida ku, shida kubwa sana kwa ndoa mingi ni kiburi kiburi yani utaki kusema pole ama sitaki kusamehea ama unaona mtu makosa yake ni kubwa kushinda hii dunia na yako ina yani kiburi unatoa ile yeah. unaona yani unaona wewe unaona wewe better than the other person unaangi shida zako so, eh hey, so hiyo kukua kuo in self righteousness yeah. nasema ndio pia ina uanga ndoa mingi sana so mimi naweza sema kuweka Yesu kwa moyo zetu na kuweka Yesu katikati Mungu katikati ya ndoa yeah. imetusaidia kuzua Mungu ametufundisha kusameana yeah. na kupendana regardless okay kwa upande wako mo sisi marafiki Aha, friendship. Simple as that is. Mm. Sisi ni marafiki. Aha. Always yes. fanyizo vjole ka nyizi marafiki. Yes. Then ndako mna force. Ah. Yeah, it starts from there. Friendship, friendship. It starts from there, it ends there. Ni kwa sababu acha ni explain. You see most people marry somebody bibi, uko na bibi ama bwana, lakini apart from mambo zenu za ndoa, hamwezi ongea. Like naweza en kupigia moto shinde tu mimi na yeye na tuko sawa si kazi Ama tunafanya nothing kwa simu eh ama tuna, tunafanya nothing yani we are just friends unaona wewe unaweza hang out na friend yako hivyo ndo tunakuangana mo tunaweza hang out na friends yani apart from ah, mapenzi yeah. ah. you are friends secret si, yani <laughs> nikiboeka naweza mcall nimwambie nikiwa na kitu nikiwa na udaku naweza mpigia nimwambie ama yeye niambie yani we are friends ah, <laughs> we are friends na, natoka kwa meeting wewe eh, ukasikia udaku eh na 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 mpigia na mwambia wewe usikie simu ni kwambia udaku asingine si usii kitu ya maana tunaambiana si ati kupigiana tu kuambiana eh nyanya hakuna kitunguu hakuna <laughs> eh, uko wapi ni usiku hapana yani tu kwa yani friendship and most relationships yeah. friendship inaishanga kwa sababu hakuna kusameana Aha. of course, of course ndoa mtakosana mta lakini mkisameana purely mm. friendship remains 
Unaona yeah so unaona mimi na mo mm. akienda ki travel na miss mimi ni ki travel ana ni miss oh yeah yeah friends unapata na kuna rafiki kile kitu kitu ambao wana impact pia the life na pia mwa watu kutoka sehemu moja hadi nyingine especially kuhusisha kwenye album msanii mm. kama Peter Blazing mm. eh ambao umemshirikisha kwenye wimbo mm. why did you think of Peter Blazing on this one Nilikuwa tu kwa mtandao nikaona nyimbo yake. Mm. Nikafeel ushaifeel mtu na ujui ni kwa nini. Mimi mm. think ni, ni Mungu saidini weka mtu kwa roho ya. Mm. Nikamwangalia nikaambia Mungu tafadhali saidia huyu kijana uh. muinue tu mkumbuke uh-huh. in another way yeah. like mkumbuke Mungu muinue ako na talent mm. eh, ameona mambo mingi Mungu mkumbuke. Mm. Alafu at that time nikakumbuka na fan album. Uh-huh. Nikasema si ni mshirikishe kwa nyimbo moja tu. Uh-huh. Na nikaambia Mungu tupate nyimbo mzuri. Uh-huh poa yenye ita ita, ita it, yani aki yani itamtoa yani yeah. yani na nikamtu nikampigia simu akuamini eh yeah. nilitafuta namba yake si alinitafuta mimi nilimtafuta wow. nikatafuta namba yake nikampigia simu nikampigia alikwanza alishtuka hata yeye mwenyewe atakwambia alishtuka eh usaze tule mmoja <laughs> nikamwambia eh yeah. nakwambia nikamuuliza uko wapi uko busy nataka tupata na studio uh-huh. Akanambia leo leo nikamwambia leo leo afternoon. Uh-huh. Akasema tunaimba wimbo yangu ama tunaimba wimbo <laughs> yako ama tunafanya collab. Nikamwambia nataka tufanye collab. Akashtuka mtoto wenyewe. Tukakuta na studio hakuamini. Oh. Yaani hakuamini kabisa. Uh-huh. Alafu tulipofanya wimbo tuka ataka akata aliperform kwa album launch. Uh-huh. Bado hakuwa naamini. Hata venye tu aliperform album launch alikuja jua akaniambia na album launch watu walipenda hii song. Sije pensi. Mm-hmm. Watu kwa album launch watu walipenda hii song sana. So he was very grateful akanambia yeah. yani ni vizuri nikamwambia mimi sitaki chochote kutoka kwako sitaki kukusaini ah well, sitaki pesa kutoka kwako ni collaboration tu wewe fanya collab song iki hit wakikuita eh, fanya no show kula pesa yako ah. sina haja na wewe ah. siye si ati nataka anything from you ah. ombi langu tu ni milango zako zifunguke okay. hata hiyo kamstua zaidi nikamwambia hii album nimepapa siku grow watu kuna hata msichana anaitwa Emi Emi Magale hiyo mm. no, hakuna mtu anamjua sana yeah. she's a gospel artist yes. anaimbanga pambio kanisani mm-hmm. pia yeye tuli ni, ni, ni introduce wana Francis uh-huh. akaniambia kuna huwa nikamwambia hata siku hata nimesikia song yake nikamwambia wacha tu akuje can she sing uh-huh. anapenda Mungu muite so nimefanya iko hii album iko na three upcoming artists ama growing artists mm-hmm. iko na uh, Peter Blessing, Emi Magale, alafu sasa at least yule anajulikana kidogo ni David Wanda. Mm-hmm. So in my heart I told God wacha hii, hii album ilewa watu wengi si mimi tu. It's not okay. for me only yeah. What were you considering in picking artists that you are featuring in your album? Nothing. Ah. Imagine nothing. Even if for secular. Ah, ah, ah okay. Ya yeah, of course lazima ube gospel, but siku ana katiria yote juu nilisema nikianza ku the only thing is Are you born again? Unapenda Mungu umeokoka uh-huh. na unaimba nyimbo za gospel. Uh-huh. Upcoming artist. Uh-huh. But nilikuwa naangalia nikianza kuangalia katiria mingi watu wengi wata follow off. Unaona? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Kama mtu kama Amy nikianza kuangalia following ni msichana very new, very fresh. Yeah. Very you understand? Mm-hmm. Ana tukifanya rehearsal babe nakumbuka venye alikuwa amestuka. Mm-hmm. Mbaka alikuwa anasema mama niimbe na mask kuogopa. Tukifanya rehearsal ya album yeah, she's never had such a platform. Oh. Yaani so mimi nilikasema mimi nikakumbuka nikianza uh-huh. Watu wengi walininalify. Ya yeah, walikuchukulia poa. Eh waliniongezea wali eh huyu hakuna malice zetu anaenda. Mm. So nikasema Mungu nitumie mimi mm. kama platform, mm. kama njia, kama stone wengine waonekane in the album. Yes. Okay, kuna mtu kama Iani pia amehusika. Mm-hmm. Iani ni msanii ambaye anafanya secular. Mm-hmm. Iani ni msanii ambaye ametoa wimbo ambao unaitwa Pombe. Tijaisikia by the way. Tijaisikia. Tijaisikia. For real. Eh so watu wengi wali wali that DJ mo wali jua. Na jua zote. Mimi nafanya DJ. Na kuja na kazi. Na kuja na kazi. Na kuja na kazi. Mimi nilikabab na na idea kumweka yani kwenye ngoma. But the other thing that I say just minute. Wacha ni wacha ni somewhere. Wacha kuambie. Wacha ni kuambie. We had gone somewhere mm. tulikuwa na event mm. Eldoret. Eldoret. Mm-hmm. Then I met this tulikuwa masanii tuko tunaenda ku feed the needy at Jawabu yeah. Jawabu yeah. Center. Uh-huh. Eh, so tukiwa hapo kwa watoto tunawasaidia tuna tunakana tuna watoto. Then a young man approaches me very nice, very polite, mm. raw safi. Akaniongelesha raw safi, ananiongelesha vizuri, ana maneno. Yaani nikaona kijana raw safi. Honestly niliona tu mtu raw safi. Na ni rare kupata watu wako na raw Rosafi. So nikaenda kwa bwanangu nikamuuliza, "Ule ni nani Rosafi hivi?" 
ule ni nani bwana wangu akaniambia anaitwa Iani ni kama eh nikamuuliza yani yani ni artist eh bwana wangu akaniambia ni secular artist na sasa hii ndio akona the biggest secular song nikaambia bwana wangu inaitwa pombe eh pombe nikamuuliza eh nikaangalia nikauliza bwana wangu but mimi nikimwangalia na una mtu yani mtu yani ro safi siezi i don't know how to explain yeah ushaona mtu uko na tu rose na ni rare kumitwa tu rose safi so bwanangu akanambia oh ndo member secular kubwa nikasema sitaki kusikia hiyo song ju nitaanza perception yangu towards him ita change ah so unaisikia ngoma ah, ah, hata kidogo mpaka leo unajua hata sijui are you serious kwa sababu sitaki ku change ile kitu perception, perception niliona ni mjaji na ile kitu ameimba Unaona? Jumbaka tuka tukaenda studio. Badala ya kunamjua. Sikuwa namjua. Alikuja kanza huyu ni nani? Na yani usuni. Very very nice. Yani is a very cool. Humble, very yani ni cool, humble, very, very nice, cool. very respective, respectful. Yani ni always smiling. Always smiling. Yes, always grateful. <laughs> yani it's rare to meet such a person. Unajua? Ni ukweli. Sasa ndio nika nika bwanangu akanambia wewe ndio ako na now the biggest secular song sai. Nikasema mm-hmm. sitaki kusikia hiyo song because it will change. Kwa hivyo mpaka sasa hivi sijasikia. Sijasikia. Hata secular hata moja yake sijasikia. Because sitaki inibadilishe ni anze kumwangalia sasa na flesh na mm. kwa sababu biblia inatuambia mm. tuangalie mtu na roho okay. unaangalia so nikianza kumjudge na ile kitu ameimba nikamuuliza hata nikamuuliza tukaongea sana tukaongea akaniambia nikamuuliza na feel uko na seed ya god hivyo ndio mimi nilimuuliza niliona seed ya Mungu ndani yake mm. nikamwambia mimi na feel uko na seed ya god wewe ni mtu extraordinary na hata kingdom ya god uta shake sana mm. akaniambia hata nishaiandika gospel ah aha akaniambia aliandika hii nyimbo 5 years ago nikamwambia niimbie hiyo ndio nyimbo iko kwa album Allah he wrote it 5 years ago na ndio mimi mmefanya yes hey, a very deep song. a very deep gospel deep. song he wrote it 5 years ago when he started singing the song nikasema you see because everyone alikuwa ananishuku when he sang that song the whole studio watu walianza kulia Oh my. Oh really? Yes, kwa sababu nyimbo ni deep. Yaani si yaani si gospel juju. Gospel deep. Yaani kila mtu alikuwa kwa eh tulikuwa wengi kwenye studio. Watu yaani walikuwa emotional. Yaani watu mpaka nikamwambia hii nyimbo hii wimbo umeimba imejaa. Watu na wimbo zalisha ngoma. Eh yaani wimbo imejaa uwepo wa Mungu. Akaniambia alikuwa very deep that time kwa God akiandika hiyo song. Na mimi nikasikia Roho Mtakatifu akiniambia usikubali hiyo song ipotee kwa ujumbe ufike. Wacha ujumbe itoke. Juu hiyo ngoma ni Mungu alimpatia. Nikasema nitaimba na yeye. Watu wakinipiga mawe ni sawa. Okay. Mimi simuoni na ile ameimba. Mimi naona na ile kitu iko ndani yake. Okay. Unaona kwa sababu mimi nikamwambia yani when I was singing secular, watu wange dhani utakuwa hata. Nina Mungu wote, any seed in me. Yeah. Unaona kwa sababu tunaangalia anga watu tuna write off. Unaunderstand? Mm-hmm. Na mimi nilikamwambia ni ni, ni ni rea kupata mtu ako kwa dunia ana roho kama yako. Hivyo ndo nilikuwa namwambia. Hauna maneno respectful nini? Hata yani venye hata naongelesha bwanangu, venye ananiongelesha sijui kwa unanielewa. And when we recorded this song nilipenda. Na ndio number one song kwa album. So ingo mo, uh, ni yako ni yenu written by Ian. Oh. Tumeimba pamoja uh-huh. lakini ni vizuri niseme ukweli. Uh-huh. It is written by Ian. Hata venye nilitumia bwanangu after tutoke studio, ni Ian alikutumia man mimi. I think ni Ian alinitumia kwanza. Na ni Ian alitumia. Hebu abe ka ulishtuka hata wewe. Baadaye hata siko amini. Tunajua sasa tulibonga wakaenda studio tu kujibamba. Yaani nikaona amenishia kwa WhatsApp nikasikiza nikasikiza it's a very deep but you tafikiria cuz venye tunajua yani from marafiki na nina nini to hii ngoma hawezi i mean the same person and he wrote the song five, five years, years ago, ago. Yeah. Years very ago. deep in god yes i want to know his testimony yes you know come let me do let me to let ah the bidi not know his testimony yes He eh? must have a story. Na unajua DJ Mo, DJ Mo ni DJ, kazi ya DJ. Eh. Yeah. Anajua kitu kizuri, sauti nzuri, wimbo mzuri, yeah. kali sana. Yeah, so listen, let's listen to this song but remember kwenye mambo mseto round hii hapa ya tatu tutakuwa tunapea na 5000 baadaye kidogo na swali